so it's a couple days later and now I'm finally able to show you guys what I got from Target. I got a lot of stuff surprisingly. I didn't think I would get as much stuff as I did. I just want to point out that as you can see like the words on the wall is backwards and when I hold up a product the words on the bottle or like the container is just going to be backwards i'm recording with my front camera just because i like to see like what i look like when i record so first i'm gonna start off with all of my skincare stuff so one of the first things that i end up purchasing was my body wash and for my body wash i use this coconut coffee scrub and wash from the brand ogx and i really do like this soap it smells so good. I actually just started using this scent. I used to use the rose water one, the pink one in the same brand and I'll insert a picture of what that one looks like. I actually love that one too, um, but I feel like that's more of like a summer scent. For the fall and the winter, I've started using the coconut coffee one and I honestly think I'm gonna switch to this scent permanently because I don't know, it just smells so good. I actually prefer this wash more than Dove, which is surprising because I have been using Dove pretty much my whole life. Um, but when I switched to this soap, I feel like my skin was like on another level of softness. So the next skin product that I ended up getting is the Dove Exfoliating Body Polish. And this is in the scent Crushed Macadamia in Rice Milk. I ended up getting this primarily to use on like days that I shave. And I also like to use this in the bath just like to pamper myself. This is actually like my first time trying this brand. Um, for my exfoliator, I have been using the Tree Hut brand. And although I really do like that, I feel like it wasn't really doing anything to my skin. I'm really excited to try this brand and see what it has to do for me. And plus it's Dove. What could go wrong with Dove, you know? So the next body product that I ended up getting is the EOS Shape Better. 24 hour moisture body lotion and this is in the scent coconut waters i usually moisturize for coconut oil coconut oil for me just does the job perfectly but i've noticed that when i apply the coconut oil before i go out or put on my my day clothes it kind of stains my clothes a little bit it kind of leaves like those faint little oil stains i'm kind of just like over that so i ended up getting this lotion as my daytime moisturizer and sticking to the coconut oil during the night when I'm going to bed. Now I have like never personally bought this brand to use it but I actually have a friend who does use this brand and I used some of her lotion before and let me just say that when I did use her lotion my skin just felt so soft and I really like the scent of it as well. I really feel like that the coconut water scent will go perfectly with the coconut coffee body wash that I just showed you earlier and I also went on ahead and got the the same brand lotion in the same scent in a hand cream and i'm not really the one to wear gloves and i need to start but so i went on ahead and i picked up this hand cream to keep my hands moisturized and i have already used this because i had went out to dinner literally like the next night and i bought this with me and my hands stayed soft the whole night and i feel like it really does well in cold seasons so the next product that I ended up getting is the Noxzema Classic Clean Original and this one is made with real eucalyptus extract. Now I swear by this stuff. I have been using this stuff since I was, I want to say, a junior in high school and now I'm like a junior in college. So that's like what, a good four years. This stuff never fails. So as you can see, this stuff is like a not really a soap, it's more of a cream. And so I've used this stuff for multiple things. I usually like wash my face with it and then apply it. And then when I get in the shower, I leave it on as a mask. I also use it as a spot treatment when I go to bed. It kind of has like a strong medicine smell. That's the only thing about it. But it also makes my skin feel really clean because I know that when after I rinse this stuff off my face it has like that cooling effect on my face which i really love the next product i ended up getting is the cetaphil moisturizing lotion and this one is for dry to normal or sensitive skin 
I do use this stuff all year round and I've never had a problem with it and I don't think that I'm going to be switching this out for any of the moisturizer anytime soon just because of how simple it is. I have pretty sensitive skin and this moisturizer has never bothered me. So the next product I ended up getting is the Dr. Tools Foaming Bath with Pure Epsom Salt. And this one has melatonin and essential oils just to help you sleep. I feel like this stuff will be beneficial for me for multiple reasons. I go to the gym often and often I'm pretty sore. So um, I feel like this stuff will help me a lot when it comes to me dealing with all of the aches and the pains that come with working out. I have also have had trouble sleeping lately and I really hope that this stuff will help me fall sleep faster so the next thing that i got for my skin is this low vitamin c berries and it's a sheet mask i have never used this mask before i actually went into target looking for a specific brand but the brand that i have been looking for was not there and i was very disappointed they really helped me calm down so i knew i could not leave target without finding some sort of face mask so the next product that i ended up getting is the dove zero percent aluminum deodorant and i got this one in the scent cucumber and green tea scent and i do believe that this scent is the best scent out of all the scents offered in the zero percent aluminum collection the first thing that i got for my oral hygiene is the peroxide care deep clean by arm and hammer to go with that toothpaste i ended up getting just a basic bottle of listerine cool mint but i ended up getting it in a smaller size because i wanted to have a travel size to keep in my school bag the next thing that i ended up getting is the burt's bees conditioning mocha lip scrub i was originally looking for the bird's bees chapstick in the scent pomegranate but that was sold out but um i ended up finding this instead never tried this one before but i did uh look at the reviews before i bought it it has mixed reviews some people said that it worked for them other people said that it didn't um so i'm just gonna try it on my own and see if it works or not the next thing that i ended up getting and i apologize if i pronounce this wrong is the maui moisturizer hair care and this is the heal and hydrate plus shea butter conditioner and y'all i cannot get over how good this stuff smells i have been using a shea moisture conditioner but when i switched to this brand i really feel like i saw a difference within my curls after deep conditioning with this stuff now the last product i got doesn't actually go on my body it's actually for my room this is the airwick infused with essential oils and this is in the scent blue agave and bamboo bet you're wondering why this is a part of the hygiene haul i believe that a big part of hygiene has everything to do with the cleanliness of your area and i don't know about you guys but coming back to a clean space after you just took a nice relaxing bath as well as a space that smells good is really important to me so that was the last product of my hygiene haul i really appreciate you guys and I will see you guys in the next video.